Yo, what's up? Brain is back with some more Scarlet Nexus. Oh man, I have been paying attention a lot more to this game lately. I love this game. I'm glad I'm back to doing this stuff. Um, it, we left off on some craziness. I mean, I don't know what to think still. I mean, I think that uh, Yuido is like an other, maybe. I don't know. He's like an other. I don't know what's going on with the medicine he took. I don't know. Anyway, um, hey, please make sure you smash the like on this video, please. Uh, helps the channel out tremendously. I can get more of these out. And um, yeah, without further ado, let's go. So I don't necessarily know what I, well, I mean, I guess what I got to do is to bond, right? I probably won't show all the bond episodes on here because they're pretty lengthy, right? I mean, <laughs> last time I was doing this, or the last time it was like incredibly lengthy. So I think I'm just gonna like, maybe I'll cut some out. We'll see. Um, do I have any gifts? Uh, okay, I tricked her. Okay, dokie, my bad, my bad. So they all have bonds except for her, I think. So um, yeah, that was a lot. That was a lot of stuff. <laughs> anyway, it's okay, it's okay. But we're gonna we're gonna head on. I think we're gonna end the phase or the standby process, I, I guess. Should try to get a little rest. A message from Major General Fubuki? It's Fubuki. I want an update on your situation. Rendezvous where we met previously. I got a message from Major General Fubuki. Did everyone else get it too? I did. I did too. I think he's talking about the safe zone. He said he's under surveillance. So I am sure he just wanted to play it safe. But Major General Fubuki is with Spring Pharmaceuticals. Right? Those ampules. Do you think he knows about that factory? It would be strange if he didn't. He might have a purpose for calling a meeting so soon afterwards. The fact that the OSF hospital prescribed the drugs must mean the government's getting products from that factory in some shape or form. Could Major General Fubuki be the go-between? Does that mean he's an enemy too? Even after everything he's done for us? Hmm. It could just be one of the ways he goes about pretending to obey the government. We can sit here and doubt his intentions all day, but we're better off just asking. You have a big heart, Yuito. Your trusting nature is one of your most likable features. I should really follow your example. It's because he's sincere. I think our skepticism might provide him a nice balance. <laughs> that might be true. I wish someone said that about me. Sorry to call you out here. While I accepted Luca's generous invitation the last time, I feel it would be dangerous for me to frequent your hideout. There's a good chance the team surveilling me will notice. We appreciate your consideration. Wataru told me what happened in Ceyron. I've also given the government a report that won't affect our activities. What? Is that safe? Your family is spring pharmaceuticals. That's precisely why I did. Reporting my own family's wrongdoings only gets the government to trust me more. Besides, Karin and I were the first ones to propose that research facility. What? I think you already know about Alice. She's still being held in that facility as an other. We enticed Ceyron in order to protect her, knowing full well they would abuse their research. The results of which were the ampules and the uprising. We were fools. What's going on with this country? Ceyron may have incited an uprising, but there's still a new Himuka city just like ours. Suo's conducting human experiments, and Ceyron is basically doing the same thing. All of it being done to develop new weapons to fight the threat of the others. One chose to strengthen powers, and one explored a method to control the others themselves. What are others, anyway? I've heard they suddenly began appearing after the Spring of Extinction, but not much is known about them still. That's true. I guess the only other thing we know is that they're created in the Extinction Belt. Some are saying they're wild animals that experience sudden mutations, but are they really wild? 
It's very possible that the government is hiding what they actually are. That is the crux of it. Huh? Even the public can sense something different about the others. So, focusing on that point will nullify the government's personality rehabilitation efforts. Like exposing a government secret to every new Himuka citizen? Just like my brother did in the uprising. Exactly. Karan and I once plotted to send a video of a human at the moment of being metamorphosed straight to the minds of every citizen. But we couldn't find any definitive video to serve as our evidence, and I was hampered after they threatened Karan. So that's why you let the government turn you into a spy? Yes. But now they should have Nagi's data from when Naomi was metamorphosed for research purposes. They took his memory when they subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Now that you mention it, Nagi seemed like he had no idea about Naomi's metamorphosis after he was discharged from the hospital. B but wouldn't that cause brain damage? Extracting a specific memory is a dangerous process, but that's hardly even a concern to them. You all have the same memory of her metamorphosis, but attempting to digitize and extract it is too risky. That's why we need Nagi's stored memory data. It's already been extracted. We can send the data via Arahabaki to every citizen as proof of the government's inhumane acts. The people are ready to hear it. Can you access it? Yes. I received permission to enter the secure site while you were heading out to Ceyron on your last assignment. I've been provided with a one-time use pass. Nagi's stolen memory. Where is it stored? I think they're storing it in the old OSF hospital you infiltrated before. I'm sorry for not having more concrete intel, but that facility was used to research powers. It's very likely it's there. Could you infiltrate the old hospital after the platoon has been reorganized? Reorganized? Uh, I forgot about that. I'm... I'm staying in Yuita platoon. This isn't... <sighs> This isn't the world I want either. I see. So Hanabi is the only one that needs to be transferred. No, I'll stay too. Are you sure? Staying with us could mean being targeted by the government. Then we'll deal with it if it comes to that. After all the awful things we learned, I can't just sit here and do nothing while my friends are trying to do something about it. You don't care if it brings trouble to your family? No. And I'm actually starting to suspect that it wasn't just my uncle who knew, but my father, too. Thank you, Hanabi. Your help means a lot to me. I'll leave you to recover Nagi's memory from Naomi's metamorphosis. I'd like to go myself, but I don't want them revoking my access to Arahabaki, so I have to lay low for now. You've made a lot of waves, Yuito. You need to be careful. This will be your second time infiltrating the hospital. Yes, I will. By the way, I can send you some data to help you bypass the old hospital security system. I may not be as good as my sister, but I can still put together a program or two. Please use this to aid your infiltration. Thank you. Well, good luck. I don't know how I feel about that right now. All right, we got to go back to this damn hospital. I'm really glad the whole platoon was able to work as a team. I don't know, man. I mean, we got to go back to this damn hospital again. I don't know. A resource reading near here. You can't see it, but the other is still around. Use SAS to find it. Thanks for coming. Okay, I was gonna say we got ghost ones now. Hey. I can hit it. It's here. It must be deeper inside the building. Probably somewhere very hard to get to. Probably. Uh, okay, where we go? I got too much jelly. I'm stupid. Just don't mind me, okay? Yeah, 
mysterious text data. Uh, the research of human experiment H13 will conclude today. Tests were conducted both five and 10 years ago, but results were inconclusive. Considering the subject's age, we have considered there's nothing more to expect. H13 is out of my hands now, so starting today, I will be helping with testing IO7. Knowing IO7 already had a supervisor made me curious as to whether or not I was, it was, I was necessary. But now I understand. IO7 is a subject that requires special care. It seems our instructions are to test carefully and double down on safety measures. This is that's uh, this isn't uncommon, and but it sure is a pain. Hmm. Who they talking about? I hate that. Yuito, I can disrupt the security system with Major General Fubuki's program. You can proceed safely. Understood. Yeah, but what are we talking about? Wait. Look at the map really quick, because I know... Okay, so... Where the hell am I? Oh, okay. Okay. So... I know, dude. I just wanted to make sure I'm going the right way. Ah, crap. Why? How did I not think that there was not going to be a fight here? Clairvoyance, right? Yep. Stop cutting me with your blade feet. Damage to outer shell confirmed. Keep going and break it. Come on. Oh, I was like. Fatality. I love that shit. All right, clairvoyance again. Oh, F you. Stop it. Get up. I'm stuck. Which one did I come from, though? Uh, I, don't, I guess it's this one. Okay, anyway. <laughs> Do you need help? I, I should have known there was going to be enemies in there, because, like, why not? Oh. Stop it! Okay, you got it. Okay, there we go. All right, what we got? Uh, IO-7 is in a, a fine state of health, but it appears the official word is that the subject is of weak constitution. However, even though we are sharing management duties, I'm not sure letting the subject play freely in the ward is wise. I suppose the nurse will take responsibility if anything were to happen. 
Are they talking about him? Are they talking about Yuito? Because it's just kind of... It just kind of seems obvious. Like, like, I don't know, just... I don't know, not obvious, but... It just kind of... Oh, I gotta wait for the build back up. Yeah, well, you don't have any right now. No, it just sounds kind of... I don't know. He said he was already in this hospital, right? Like, he was... What the fuck was that? I have not the slightest idea. I don't even care. All right, anyway. Oh, wait, let me make sure I'm going the exact right way, though. Am I going? No. Wait. Am I going the right way? I'm supposed to go this way, right? Or am I, like, yeah, I'm going the wrong way. An OSF member is always ready to deploy. <laughs> Okay, back at it. I'm pretty sure, yeah, because there's the safe guy, right? Nice, wait, let me get some more jelly. Jelly! All right, let's go. I'm level 30 or 31? I think, yeah, level 30. 31, anyway. By the way, how have you guys been as well? You guys, week, weekends, how have you guys been the past couple of months, actually? Because it's been a while since I spoke to any of you. Yeah, I'm not... Yes, I know. Shut up. There's gonna be multiple. The enemy dropped something rare. Thanks, Gumi. It's now. Give it everything you've got. I tried. That's okay. What was that? Well, it was weird because, like, she protected me or somehow or something. That was pretty sweet, actually. Ghost was the little baby. Look at him. The little baby. Am I going backwards? No idea. Anyway. Do you remember the layout of the building? You were admitted to this hospital when you were little. Uh, that's what I hear, but I don't remember it at all. I guess I was too young. You definitely were too young. How come we didn't see all this yellow shit right here when we were here the first time? He up. Really? 
You just gonna mess up my whole flow like that? I just saw that invisible bastard over there. I didn't turn this into a little, little haunted little hospital. Uh, problems were reported with subject H13, a subject we gave up on and were including test, uh, testing on. The subject was a bit rebellious, but uh, we can't let this problem develop further, seeing as we can't discharge the subject as is. We will follow protocol and move to corrective measures. I'm pretty sure they're talking about him. I don't know, it just sounds kind of tough. Don't mess with me. Bro, hold up. I, I hate when, but I know this. You don't have to remind me, brother. Nothing to note on today's test. I was seven is crying for their mother. This closest to the mother may be the result of too much special treatment. I can't say that our seven's brain is that spectacular. There is a possibility for success, but even in that case, I wonder if we'll achieve the result we want. Yeah, I mean, I guess I hear something nasty, like slithering and shit. Like, what is that? Oh, crap. Okay. Uh, I've got to sit here and wait for the. That's bull. Well, I mean, I can't really. I'll hit the. Stop throwing shit at me. Ah. That sucked butt, dude. All right, anyway. I mean, I really couldn't do much except for like, I like I'm fighting the other one and the, the, he disappears. So I like, I don't know. Oh my God. Oh. Thanks. Sorry for the trouble. Thank you. Oh, so you can revive me only when she's in that state? That pisses me off. I hate. That's so cheesy. Yo, mama.
I hate that bastard. Asshole. Jesus. Like I don't I don't know what the difficulty was with that, but that was that was that was that was that was butt. I hated that one. I didn't like that at all. <laughs> no, it was that was just unlucky, man. That was ooh. Thank goodness for uh Oh thank goodness for the uh save spot though, cause that shit. But why the I mean, they're dancing. I gotta get that data though, right? That was... Thanks, Takumi. I need your help. I need you, Kemma. Mess it with me. Do you need help? Okay, you shouldn't have got that. I don't know how you got that, but you can probably hear me pressing buttons. What's the point of this? Could have probably just walked down this way. Kept going. I mean, it, uh, was this something I was supposed to get here? Or am I, or am I what? I don't know. What, what is the, um, the legend thing here? What is that? Why was I going? Nope. Nope. Fighting right now. Uh, we'll be able to move forward if we use my power, Yurito. Lend me your eyes. <laughs> Well, I mean, whatever. I don't think I was supposed to be here, but it is what it is. I'm just trying to survive. Go, Yuito. Ah, shit. Why not? Die! 
That's how we beat it. I don't like the way that looks. Damn, I tried. Why are you over there fighting? She she didn't took off. Really? Oh my god. Okay, what the hell happened there? I hit the outer shell. I think I can break it if I focus my attacks. Time to use this. Oh Jesus, leave me alone. Looks like the enemy dropped something rare. Lend me your eyes. Is everyone okay? Thank you. I'm sprouting. I'm sprouting. Shut up. I'm mad right now. That little dancing bastard. Okay. Um, I can go in here. Or is there a reason I should? Or... H13 has been killed. They were slated for disposal. But would that be better than being alive? I don't want to think about it. The hospital's in chaos. I shouldn't be making making this recording either but this is why uh, the only way i can preserve my thoughts i don't want to lose any precious test samples if they didn't take notice of the alarm they might have made not have made it out regardless this place is finished eh okay I know there's some jelly and stuff in there, but I always run out of, not run out of jelly, but I can never eat it. Ah, God dang it. F you. All right, let's go. Let's go. So I did read that correct. You can do a uh, a read attack. Like if you dodge perfectly, you get to do like an extra attack. I like. I've been trying to do that, and I don't. I'm like I don't know what I'm doing. Well, she hit him. Did you see that? She should have. That should have put him down. That should have worked. Yo mama, man. Leave it to me. Come on. Go, go. Here we go. I can hit it. 
Yep, here we go. Apparently, I dodged it perfectly enough. Thank you. Bro, get the hell out of here with this shit. Okay, you know what? The forecast reading was zero percent, but we're being uh, attacked by so many at once. It's unbelievable. The OSF who are fighting back are likely those who happen to be here as patients. The main force hasn't arrived from Suo yet. The entrance to the lab should have been sealed when the alarm went off. I can't go back up there. Ahead, uh, ahead, up ahead. There's an employee. Uh, system message could not recognize voice entry, saving text and ending voice entry. Hmm. Yeah, so the OSF were patient. So that's, I mean, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, so we're in the same, we gotta go to the same spot. Where all these crazy red TVs were. We gotta fight that big ass monkey dude again. I mean, whatever, let's do it. That almost scared me. That lady, I swear to God, I don't know what she, her problem is. It doesn't look like they're storing data anywhere. I don't even see anything resembling research equipment. I think the facility is underground, but there weren't any stairs leading down from the first floor. We'll just have to comb the area ourselves. If this is where they conducted his personality rehabilitation, Nagi's data should be here. I wonder if Nagi managed to get away. I had all of you there to rescue me, but he was alone. You're still as kind as ever. Nagi! You did come back. Of course you did. I mean, we're best friends, aren't we? Looks like Nagi received even more personality rehabilitation. Because Nagi was regaining his original personality the last time we saw him? Personality rehabilitation. You traitors against glorious new Himuka are the ones who need rehabilitation, not me! There's no need to worry, Yuito. They specifically told me you need to be alive when I bring you in! Lovely, let's go. Stop it, Nagi! I don't want to fight you! Then come with me! We wouldn't have to fight them. Of course, I'll kill anyone else who gets in my way. So what's it gonna be? I don't know if we can fight this one. If we don't use SAS, we don't have a chance. Don't let the personality rehabilitation control you, Nagi. You can tell it your friend. Well, remember, Nagi was a weak one. Personality 
new group and personality rehabilitated too. Let's do our best to stop them for now. He's not as hard as that chick we were fighting, I'll tell you that much. I need you, Gemma. Some help, Luca. Oh. Except for that, he got me pretty well. And that was stupid because I well, I don't know what happened there because he's not hard, but for some reason I just ended up getting caught in his bullcrap. Let's go. Keep going, keep going. No, God damn it. Are you serious? I was beating his ass. Oh, that's horrible. Bro, what the hell was that? Oh, here we go. Let's go. That was so weird. Like, why did she like... Oh, what the hell, dude? Where are you? Why does everyone keep going away? I don't know. It was just kind of weird the way they did the fight. Like. He's a little cheap. Oh, okay. Oh, I got him this time. F him. Oh, we're all doing it. Please stop this while I'm ripping him apart. <laughs> Too bad for you. I'm not done yet. Yeah. <laughs> Guys. <sighs> you and Joe. did anyway Yuito I know that was scary they're all done with the tests now Thomas let me see that brave face you're okay it's all over. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> A dream about my mom? Why would I have that now? Oh, right. This ceiling. It looks like the hospital room from when I was a kid. The smell, too. Smell. Where am I? Huh? I can't use my powers? You can't use your powers here. Those restraints are designed to nullify your abilities. You're such a fool. All you had to do was play the patriotic hero, and you would have had the world on a platter. Who are you? Just a humble staff member of this facility. We've met a number of times when you were a child, but I'm sure you don't remember. We did? Have you forgotten about your time here in the hospital with your mother? Which means this is still somewhere inside the old OSF hospital. Where are my friends? No idea. Your friends are outside my jurisdiction. 
I'm in charge of duds. You mean people without powers? That's right. I was in charge of the experiments involving you and the Travers brothers. Unlike Karin and Luca, it seems like your psionic hormone levels are dropping. What? Now that I think about it, your psychokinesis was activated under some unconventional circumstances. Duds have an extremely low chance of manifesting powers in the first place. This could mean there's something special about your cerebrum. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Oh, wow. I'm a dud? Oh. So you're missing your memories from when you were a dud, too. This is going to be tricky. It seems your brain is accumulating damage as you use your power. I need to run some tests before I ask you any questions. I'm sure you've experienced episodes of sudden memory loss or having difficulty remembering your childhood. Wait! Please, explain it to me so I can understand. <sighs> it's simple. You were born a dud. Then you were hospitalized here with your mother, because this was still the OSF hospital at that time. We know that duds are capable of acquiring potent powers. The country sends all duds to this hospital, where we run medical experiments on them. I'm a dud? I had no powers? In any case, it's time to go back to sleep. Wow. Damn it! I can't stay awake. Yuito! Are you alright? Major General Fubuki? How... The program he gave us was able to tap into the facility's surveillance camera feed. I knew it would be dangerous infiltrating this place. I made sure I would be available if something happened. Thank you very much. I'm glad you guys are all right. I'm sorry, Major General. We couldn't get Nagi's memory data. Uh, right, Nagi. What happened after that? You suddenly collapsed, and Nagi... He took you, and then used you as... as a hostage. We were afraid of hurting you, so we couldn't attack him. We were locked inside a room. There was strange equipment. I think it was for personality rehabilitation. But Major General Fubuki showed up before any of us were rehabilitated, so we're all okay. You don't have to worry about us. Sorry. You're always rescuing me. Thanks, guys. Wait. It looks like... Others are gathering. I've disconnected the alarm, but they should already know Yuito's trying to get away. We have to escape the hospital. I've already shared the way out with Wataru. I'll hold them off here. But... Don't forget, I'm a Septentrion. I can handle myself. Take this. Don't lose it, no matter what. What is it? I'll tell you when we get out of here. Now go. You'll only get in my way. Okay. I don't see any safe area near here for teleporting. We have to run. Got it. Please, be careful. Oh, we gotta fight our way out. I was a dud. I'm more confused than shocked. I am too, dude. Nagi must have attacked Yuito under orders from the new Himuka government. We should consider him as being completely under the government's control. I can't see it, but the other is still around. Use SAS to find it. I need to support the injured. It's down. Give it everything you've got. Now die! 
That's crazy though. Like, so he was a dud. I thought it was an other or something crazy. Like I said, I'm usually wrong because I'm not good at this stuff. But <laughs> no, but I I was just like, there's some like. So that's why they were giving him that medicine. So he already, so the doctor or that girl's aunt or that girl's uncle, I believe, she already knew about him, I imagine. And that's why she, or why he gave her, or him the medicine, right? I'm, I, I guess so. Anyway. Former Major General Karin? Uh oh. Yuito, it looks like you finally become a traitor too. What do you mean? Did the new Himuka government brand Yuito a traitor? Yep. Yes. I doubt you'd be allowed inside Suo. <sighs> Come to Seiron. You'll all be accepted as one of them. You're asking us to help Seiron? The same people who are sticking human brains inside others? Meanwhile, New Himuka is conducting experiments to metamorphose humans all in the name of producing a strong power. And at its center is the great city Suo. They're both twisted. They're both crazy. Then what do you want to do? Run to the religious fanatics in Togetsu? They're a religious state. They'd probably be open to taking in criminals such as yourselves. But Togetsu won't necessarily be a safe place this time around. This time? Just a figure of speech. Yeah. New Himuka won't be able to get us in Togetsu. They're an independent city. It is a little shady, though. Is that why you came here, Karin? To tell us this? <laughs> it was just an afterthought. However, take this if you're going to Togetsu. I can't drink this. I won't. Whether it's human blood or brains, you need to drink it if you want to live. Either way, you'll lose all your memories and powers if you choose to do nothing. The drugs are simply giving you time, so you have to drink it whether you like it or not. But why are you helping? He's up to something. But what is it? Most likely saving Pabuki. True. Should we be helping him? No. Come back to the hideout. Major General Fubuki wanted me to tell you not to worry about him. Besides, I can at least monitor his status from here. Come back so we can make a plan on whether we're helping him or running to Togetsu. All right. Aaron's Ampule. But didn't he? Well, he was the one that turned some uh, one of their friends into an other. So I don't know if I would trust hey, him. Hey, good job, everyone. Man, this unit's so cozy. Wataru, what are you doing here? I had a meeting with Major General Fubuki. I was supposed to escape to the hideout if they found out you guys snuck into the old hospital in Lokusho. I mean, I can navigate you anywhere as long as I have a PC and sign at. Which means that Fubuki predicted Yuito would be branded a traitor. So, he told Wataru to come here, since he is Yuito Platoon's operator. If they're going to make Yuito the bad guy, it makes sense to take out the person who knows what Yuito Platoon is up to. Good thing Wataru got here when he did. Otherwise, they may have subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Yep, that's basically it. I made sure they didn't know where this hideout was before I left. This was originally a unit for the Sumeragi family. It'd be bad if Chief Kaito found out we're here. But it seems like we're fine for now. I haven't told my brother that we're using this unit, but we should be careful. We own many others, so I don't think they'd find this place right away. In any case, I can't believe my brother made me into a traitor. Yuito. It's really made it clear to me that he sided with the government. Not that I didn't already know that. Anyway, since I'll be staying here from now on, rest assured that nobody will find this hideout. More importantly, do you still have the thing Major General Fubuki gave you? I have it, right here. What is it? It's for Arahabaki, a one-time-use key code generator. Why would he give something that important to... Major General Fubuki entrusted the key code generator to you because he thought he might not come back alive. Have you heard anything from him? 
I've tracked him leaving the old OSF hospital. He completely disappeared from all systems after that. I hope he hasn't been captured by the government. My brother saved Fabuki. I'm sure of it. We have nothing to worry about. That reminds me. I wonder if it's true that former Major General Karin and Luca were both duds. I'll look for him on my end, too. Besides, you guys don't have the luxury of worrying about anyone. They're calling you demons and hypocrites in Suo. Our stocks are limited. If you don't make contact with Togetsu or Seiron soon, we're gonna run out of supplies. How could they do this? They were just hailing him as a hero. It's fine. They shouldn't have been calling me a hero in the first place. There's actually something I wanted to tell all of you. It seems that I was born without powers. <laughs> but you have powers. What are you saying? You know how I was being treated at the old OSF hospital as a kid? Seems like I was subjected to an experiment that caused me to acquire my power. I think the reason why my powers have been on the fritz lately is because they were artificially engineered. It probably puts a huge strain on my mind. Are you sure you're okay with telling us this? That you used to be a dud? Oh, is he sensitive about having been a dud? I mean, hiding it doesn't change the truth. And I figured you all deserve to know, considering all the trouble my unstable power caused you. It's no trouble, really. Yeah, we're just worried about you. It's only natural for us to worry. But thank you for telling us. I've heard there are many people without powers who live their life suffering in secret. It's sad, but I do believe that is the case. And if something ever happens, you know we have your back. Thanks. All right. We should rest here a little bit and figure out what to do next. I mean, I don't know, dude. He sounded like he was a little offended about that. But, uh, yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. It'll probably be impossible to recover Nagi's memory data now. I guess this means Major General Fabuki's plan will have to be put on hold. Yep. All right, all right, all right. Uh, what did he say? All right, anyway, we're going to save it. Awesome. All right, you guys, that is my time today. Thank you so much for being here. I can't believe... I, I don't know. I was wrong. I was... I was under the impression that he might have been the other. <laughs> but anyway, um, that's fascinating. So I'm, I'm loving this. I'm glad I'm doing this, going through this again. But um, once again, thank you guys for being here. I appreciate all of you. So please smash the like button for me. It helps out tremendously. Um, I will see you in the next one, you guys. Peace.